somebody welcome back with cooking with Nana today I am going to show you how to make namban so the namban is called black bean and lotus so the main ingredients that I have is my fresh lotus right here and the um, black bean in this bag you have to soak this overnight and pan the leaf and palm sugar and I have cane sugar and it's coconut. You can use a fresh one um, to make the milk out of it or you can use the powder and the canned one. So My black bean, I soak overnight and then I will take the, you know, whatever that is open from the beans, try to look for it and take it out. Because you have to soak this overnight. If you don't soak overnight, it's takes long time to cook this is not gonna look for it still gonna look for it and then I show you how I peel my lotus roots try to get a fresh one okay cut the end here and then slice it Okay. Oh, and I forgot to mention that I have my water in my pot here. It's 24 cups of water. I'm going to put this in the stove to let it boil. boil. Okay, once I slice it, I'm going to rinse it. You see how this, we're, gonna, we're not going to use this part. And then we're gonna slice it. Okay. The pan, you don't want it too thick. So it's very thin. Because when um if it's too thick, it takes long time to cook. So I'm gonna keep cutting this up and then um, I have my pot boiling over there. I am gonna add a little bit of the pan leaf by thai into the water. See how um, it split the seeds? Um, that's the thing that I don't want it to cook. So, you know, you can try to find as much out if you can see how it split so okay once i did that i'm gonna pour in my sink drain it okay. i'm gonna check my pot if it's Boiling. I'm gonna okay. While your water is boiling, um, warm it up. You can throw in the the black bean in here and the panna, um, by the panna leaf. And then I'm gonna use four um, palm sugar. And I'm gonna let this cook for an hour. And then, and I'm gonna throw my lotus root in here. Yeah, I need to change pot. So it's been 30 minutes. I'm gonna see if, um, take the beans out, the black bean. It's still not quite cooked, but before that, I'm gonna add sugar, more sugar. I have four blocks in here. Two, four, six, eight. So it's gonna be some total. I'm gonna use 12 of this palm sugar. So I'm gonna cook more, 30, 30 more minutes into it. Yeah. There. Yeah. The bean is still not quite soft the way I want it. Some of them is it. Okay, just do another 30 more minutes. Okay. Okay, 
Okay, once I have cooked it down to an hour, you can bring it and um, check if you want your bean, black bean to be a little bit more soft. Okay, it's perfect for me. I'm going to taste the broth if I want more sweeter. Um, I think I'm going to add more sweet into it. Because I like it a little bit more sweet on making them bun. So total of all is this is um, two cup of sugar. Okay. Because you know when it's, you just turn off your heat. You just turn it off and just add um, the sugar to um, dissolve the dissolve the sugar. Okay, sweet enough. It depends how sweet you want it. So we're gonna take this um, pen and leaf out, and then you will add the coconut. Um, so like I said, you can use the can with the powder, or you can use the fresh one. So I already mixed my fresh one already. Like I said, I add um, add salts in here. So I'm gonna pour it in here. You can wait until this is cooled down. Not don't let it like too hot. Just let it cool down. Okay. If you want more cre um, coconut, we're gonna add more coconut into it. Yeah, I'm gonna add more coconut to it. Mhm. Mm more coconut. So like I add the the fresh coconut, but I want a little bit more creamy. So the sweetness is there already. I'm gonna, yeah. Mm -hmm. The sweetness is there already. So, like I said, you can use the can, but I'm gonna mix to make it more creamy because my husband likes creamy. So I'm gonna use the powder. I like to prefer using the powder more. Let's use, mm, because in this package is 13 ounce. Right here, 13 ounce. So, I'm gonna use, yeah, I'm gonna use all the package. And then I'm adding hot water. This is half cup of hot water. Let's see. Another half, so that's gonna be one cup of hot water for right now. Okay, then mix it. Mix it real good until it gets all dissolved. Okay. It's like I'm going to show you another. Say if your coconut, the powder is not enough. So I mix um, with hot water. And then if I want to add more coconut, I'm going to mix with this um, coconut too. And add just a little hot water. You see under there, there's some um, coconut cream um, under the can. Just add like a one spoon, spoon in there because all the flavor is down there. Okay, pour in here. Okay, and then we will add a pinch of salt. One, two pinch of salt because you don't want it to be too salty. Now I'm gonna taste the coconut. Mm, perfect. So you don't have to add too much salt. Here we go. I'm gonna pour in here where we want it more creamy. Mmm. Now that's how this is the Navan we're looking for. Okay. Right there. Okay, now we're gonna taste it. Another taste, like... Okay. Mmm. 
Yes. Sweet, buttery, creamy, perfect the way how we want it. So that's it. Then I will show you how I um, put into my bowl and eat it. Now, how we serve to eat this. Try to get all whatever you can get in here. Mm. Okay. And then put a crushed ice. I like mine with ice. If you like it like this with no ice, it's fine. It's up to you. But I like mine with ice. I like it cold. Okay. So, so mix it up. Yeah. Mmm, smells good. Okay, now I'm gonna taste it. Mmm, mmm, mmm. This is black bean and lotus root. Um, dessert. In Lao, we would say, "Namban Thua Dam Say Hak Dok Bua." Hmm. So, Long Beng, try it out and see how do you want their dessert to be like. So, like I said, Mother, Mother, I'm eating some can. Khop Chai, Ma Beng video, Khoi Chana. How to get my lakonder? Khop Chai. Bye.